What if Earth harbors ecosystems so alien they redefine life itself? We are talking about crushing pressure, absolute darkness. Scalding temperatures and water laced with toxic chemicals. It is the central mystery of the deep. How can anything survive, let alone thrive, in this impossible environment? The groundbreaking discovery of hydrothermal vents in the 1970s was an initial shock. The answer is chemosynthesis, microbes converting chemical energy, specific hydrogen sulfide, into organic matter. This chemical fuel forms the base of an entirely new food web, independent of the sun's light. These ecosystems showcase mind-blowing examples, such as the giant tube worms thriving near scalding hot water. From blind shrimp to the heat-defying Pompeii worms, these creatures possess unique adaptations to survive. They have evolved to cope with extreme temperatures, rapid pH shifts, and high heavy metal concentrations. A key is their unique symbiotic relationships, like bacteria living within tube worms, providing essential nutrients. Their metabolic pathways and DNA are genetically alien, differing significantly from surface life. These vents are isolated islands of life, vibrant pockets surrounded by the barren, abyssal plains. We find different types of vents, black smokers and white smokers, each supporting unique communities. They may be nurseries for new forms of life, or stepping stones for life spreading across the ocean floor. The vents connect directly to the search for extraterrestrial life, if life flourishes here without sunlight. Then and icy moons like Europa, or Enceladus, become prime targets for future exploration. The deep sea vents remind us that the universal's most extraordinary discoveries might be hidden right here on Earth, challenging everything we thought we knew about life.